Well, hello everyone, my name is Prime, and welcome back to this episode of Prime News. And today, SEO Software released another blog post on the 1.44 update coming to American Truck Simulator, focusing today on the 2022 update for the interior of the Freightliner Cascadias. So, of course, like always, the blog post will be linked down in the description below. That's where I got the six new interior shots today, and of course, the information I'll be sharing. Although the addition is definitely more on the small side, the updated interiors for the Freightliner Cascadias are definitely a nice thing to have. SES Software is adding three new interior trims that line up, of course, with the 2022 lineup from Freightliner and will be available in all four cabin types. Keep in mind with the 72-inch sleeper options, you will also find new tables and chairs that are in the back. Although fairly obvious, I'll state this now. The goal of this interior update for the Freightliner Cascadias is to bring the in-game version up to the trim level of the 2022 version. There Therefore, lining up both the in-game and real-life trim levels and current spec of the Freightliner Cascadias. Now, I'm not going to lie, I was really hoping to see an update, especially for the interiors, of the Kenworth and Peterbilt trucks that are currently in ATS. Those two trucks, of course, were part of the original game and really haven't been touched since. But I also completely understand the logistics side behind bringing this update in and the fact that Freightliner actually requested slash gave SES Software the opportunity to create the revised trim levels for the Cascadia. Say what you want about the Freightliner Cascadia, but I do have to say it is a really nice truck and it, it's nice to see now that it is completely updated or at least more or less completely updated to what the current 22 spec is. Within the last year, we've seen the update for the Cascadia on the exterior, bringing in some of the new aero options and other packages that are available on the newer trims. Ultimately, it makes this interior update make a lot of sense. May I say that update 1.44 is shaping up to be an amazing update. We've already had multiple features confirmed, and I'm sure there'll be a lot more to come as well. As I mentioned, this is definitely more on the smaller side when it comes to an addition, but it's definitely a great addition to ATS, especially for those who like to drive the Cascadia. Unfortunately, we still don't have a release date for the 1.44 update, but I am crossing my fingers that it comes sooner than later. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.